Good morning guys, welcome to Life Apollos, your number one stop for supercar community news. And today we've got kind of a crazy story guys. Last night, Toyota Mexico accidentally released uh, the new Toyota Supra promo footage. And then immediately, like five minutes later, took it down, but not before we could grab the video. So here it is guys, the brand new Toyota Supra in all its glory. <laughs> So uh, what do you guys think? I wanna know right now as we're talking about it, what do you guys think? Put in the comments below, do you like the look of it? Do you think this is gonna be like a big winner for Toyota? I know it's been a long time since we had another Super in the lineup, so I'm pretty excited about it. I'm definitely gonna be looking at this as a possible daily driver, which is kind of weird because we already have a Porsche uh, Macan Turbo, but you know, I mean, the Supras are pretty cool. It's hard for me to, to kind of deny the coolness factor of having a new Supra. The things that we don't have are hard numbers on horsepower, on weight, on price. We can guess at some of them based on what we've had some reviewers tell us so far after driving the car. So some reviewers that had the chance to drive the new Supra uh, told us that they thought it seemed like it was going to be around the 340 horsepower mark with a weight of roughly 3,200 pounds. And a lot of folks are saying right now that we're expecting the base price without any options to be somewhere in the 40 to $50,000 range. Now, obviously this is all conjecture. We don't have any hard facts until they actually release everything within a couple days. And maybe they might even be prompted after the leak to release it a little bit early. We'll have to see. I'm hoping that the Toyota Mexico guy who accidentally posted this doesn't get fired over it. Uh, because honestly, it's, it's you know, things happen. They, mistakes happen. People accidentally do that kind of stuff. So in other news, because there there is more crazy news today, we've got the Ikanu Racing actually set the world record for the McLaren 720S quarter mile time and this is this is bonkers guys you're not going to believe this with a tune down pipes and some decent tires you ready you ready for this they hit a 9.29 at 152 miles an hour absolutely insane <laughs> the fact that this is only, I say only a tune and downpipes with tires means that there is technically the possibility for this to, to really go even higher and potentially get into the eights, which uh, I mean, as fast as we thought the 720S was. I don't know if any of us thought it would be in the eight second mark. And getting down to the low nines is, is a significant achievement. So congratulations to Kind of Racing. You did a great job. I hope I'm saying your name right too. Bravo guys. So that's, that's kind of the news for today. Thanks for joining us. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like supercar community news and we'll keep bringing it to you guys. Have a wonderful day and uh, I'm Aaron Paulus. See ya.